My name is Vivian Gadsden, and I'm the chair of the committee. And I want to welcome you to this open session and thank you for taking the time to join us today. Um, normally, we would have the committee do brief introductions, but in the interest of time, I'm going to ask you just to um, come up and talk to folks after this meeting, if you would like, and we're going to forego um, those introductions. In particular, we would like to thank the sponsors um, of this study, um, a study that's focusing on an incredibly important topic that will have long-term implications. Um, I, want, I would like to begin by giving you a brief overview of what the committee has been asked to do. There are kind of four, four broad areas. One is to inform a national framework for strengthening the capacity of parents of young children birth to age eight. Second, to develop consensus recommendations to strengthen the parenting capacity. Recommendations will focus primarily on federal state and local governments, the private sector, public education systems, and health and human service systems. Next, the committee's report is anticipated to be released in February or March of 2016. And lastly, additional information about the statement of task is indicated on the handouts you received when you arrived. I'd like to give you a sense of the format for our meeting today. First, our speakers um, have been invited to discuss various topics to support the committee's statement of task. Some of these include effects of changes in U.S. policy on parents and parenting, addressing the needs of specific populations, how to implement evidence-based parenting programs at scale, and so on. The committee discussion with speakers after each speaker um, or panel and then lastly, public comment sessions during which members of the audience may present their comments on the committee's task. In addition, I want to note that this is an open on the record session. Individuals who are interested have been invited to attend as observers. I would also like to remind everyone that this is an information gathering session. That is, the committee is in the process of assembling materials that it will examine and discuss in the course of making its findings, conclusions, and recommendations. So I'm asking everyone here today to be extremely mindful of the fact that the committee has made no conclusions and that it would be a mistake for anyone to leave here today thinking otherwise. Comments made by individuals, including members of the committee, should not be interpreted as positions of the committee or of the Institute of Medicine or the National Research Council. In addition, committee members typically ask probing questions in these information gathering sessions, which may not be indicative of their personal views. The committee will deliberate thoroughly before writing its draft report. Moreover, once the draft report is written, it must go through a rigorous review by experts who are anonymous to the committee. And the committee then must respond to this review with appropriate revisions that adequately satisfy the Academy's Report Review Committee and the Chair of the Institute of Medicine and National Research Council before it is considered an IOM and NRC report. So with that, um, once again, I want to welcome you. And um, I would like to begin with the first, our first presenter who will be introduced by committee member Bill Beardsley. <laughs> 